Hi, my name is Jessica. I'm a librarian here at Warren Newport Public Library. Today I'm going to talk about The Young Elites by Marie Lu. Marie Lu is a great author. I've discussed her series Legend in these book talks before and I'm passionate about it. I call it Hunger Games Good. So The Young Elites is pretty great as well. Adelina is the main character. She is a daughter of, um, of a nobleman and she actually comes down with the blood fever, which is some sort of disease affecting um, many people within her city. Um, the blood fever, she ends up surviving, but it has turned her hair silver, her eyelashes pale, and she's actually lost an eye. Now she's considered a malfetto, which is basically like, a, like damaged goods. And so no one wants to marry her. One day she overhears her father speaking with um, a man who's come to basically purchase her and her father is agreeing to this arrangement. She runs away from home and in all of the craziness of getting away realizes her father's following her and somehow accidentally ends up killing her father. The um, government takes her to the stake and is going to basically burn her alive and suddenly she is rescued. Um, now, her malfetto-ness, or whatever, she, whatever it is that she has with her lost eye and her, her damaged goods, um, also brings about some sort of powers in her. And we know that she has powers that are not of this world, dark powers, something that is deep inside of her. And so um, this book is like kind of fleshing out her story and trying to figure out exactly what it is she can do and how she can become a young elite. A young elite is something that exists that nobody has really seen, but we know that they exist within the city and they have some special powers. So is Adelina a young elite? We're not sure, but I, I really suggest you check out this book. It's the first in a trilogy from Marie Lou. It's really just as good as Legend.